Gilert, a man's best friend, by Keris Matthews. Faster than lightning, a prim dog and steed returned to the castle at breathtaking speed. My lady, my lady, I must go away, but Gilert will guard you all night and all day. Fine, Suan trills. And their baby boy smiles. They feel quite safe with this hound at their side. While Gilert so gently and quietly creeps, the princess rocks babe till the babe falls asleep. I must go to supper. Stay watchful. Wait here. Let no one disturb him. Let nobody near. But what is that shadow? A beast on the prow? A hungry black wolf? How he skulks, how he scowls. A wolf in the bedroom? Just look at his size and he's looking at the baby with bloodthirsty eyes. Up, gullet up, and they fight and they howl. They slash and they gnash. They gnarl and they growl. They snarl and they bite. And they heave and they roll, the cradle turns over and the babe's on the floor. Wolf hisses is so monstrous, so savage, so foul. I'm hungry, where's the baby? I want him right now. Month has come, Gerlach strikes at his head, a powerful blow and the wolf is now dead. The dog is exhausted, to well in the grate. Returns for his travel, but is he too late? Faster than lightning and a prince, dog and a steed returned to the castle at breathtaking speed. The cradle is empty. Hound, what have you done? Why are you bloodstained? Oh no, my poor son. The prince lifts his sword. He knows he must kill his faithful dog, Gilad. So trusting and still. A stab and then silent. And then a faint cry. The prince lifts the sheets. The baby's alive. So when the wolf's body was found lying near, the truth of what happened was horribly clear. Oh, Gilad, I'm sorry the prince cried in pain. I'll never forget that you died in vain. The prince buried Gilad, a dignifying end. Let the world always know that you were my friend. Look up into the sky. On a dark winter's night, it's Gilad you'll find in the stars shining bright.